Hello everybody. Today I'm going to work on the forward cabin, mostly some preparations for the panel. So before closing the forward cabin, there are a lot of things you need to do. Uh, we start with the construction of the panel. As you can see, these are still all uh, non-prime parts. So it's just an initial fit and do some drilling. I drew some, let's say, potential panel, so instruments on it. It's it's very preliminary, and I'm I'm still not uh, decided what how the panel should look like. At least as you can see, I, I really like uh, symmetry, so I want everything to be sy symmetrical. Okay, I'm working on the, um, the construction of the uh, the ribs that keep uh, everything in place. There is a um, extra bar in there because later the um, the canopy crash bar has a um, has a rod to that to that point, so it uh, it is a very stiff part. Okay, I'm trying to match the uh, skin, the top skin. That's very hard because as you can see it's not pre-bent. Uh, I did it this way but later I decided to to bend it uh, a little bit because I, I think there's too much tension on everything so I, uh, I, I did some extra bending but I did that later. Also I found that it's uh, really hard to, uh, to get everything in there and to, to reach the other side. So after priming I probably need to do something else and maybe put not the um, the panel and the rips in but first the skin. I'm not sure. I, I have to look into it. There are some extra brackets that you have to build yourself. I'm working on it right now and um, they keep the, the front panel on the right position. Um, It's uh, it's hard to get the uh, the ribs <coughs> in the right place, but it uh, yeah once it's set correctly, then it's very easy. As you can see, just as the uh, top skins on the aft side, I uh, start on one side and then I work my way down all the way to the other side. Uh, but it was a little hard here, as you can see. It's uh, I almost it looks like the, <laughs> the top skin was too short. Um, as I said, I need to find a way to do that. Uh, this worked a little bit, but there was a lot of tension on the Clicos, so I don't like that. So I have to uh, find another way to to get it in there with less tension. But it worked okay, so that's good. So now uh, I start match drilling all the holes. Uh, on the forward side there are um, some some doublers some stiffeners that you have to drill completely and the rest is just match drilling. As you can see that goes very fast because all the holes are already pre-drilled pre in a uh, too small size and you just have to um, widen them up and then re clico everything and then do the other holes that were previously clicoed. So that's the procedure. Um, and here I'm trying to fit in the middle uh, extension of where the roll bar for the canopy uh, should be. And I'm now working on the extra brackets for the front panel on the right side. You have to be very careful if you drill the holes through the firewall forward. The firewall I should say. Mainly because it's steel and as soon as you drill it, it's very sharp. So if you would... You have to deburr it almost immediately because if you don't, you'll really cut your hands uh, very fast. And again, of course, I did it again. Somehow I always uh, end up bleeding <laughs> from, <laughs> from my hands. <laughs> okay, the right side also match drilling all the, all the holes. And then I can remove the skin. I 
Uh, this is actually I'm working on the uh, the construction of the, um, the center part uh, where there are some extra stiffeners. So now I can remove the skin completely, and then uh, later I can uh, prime it and uh, dimple it. So there are some extra points where you need to um, drill the holes for um, what I said earlier, the, the, the roll bar of the canopy. This is just me checking if that uh, that roll bar stiffener is okay. Huh. It's apparently not that easy. It's a good thing I found a, um, a trick to get at, uh, the middle rip out of there without uh, removing everything. I'm also still not clear where I should leave all the avionics. Uh, I've, I've no idea how to do that, so... Um, I think some people build it up on a plate in there, but I'm not sure. I should research that. But it's still far away for working on avionics, so uh, I don't. I didn't really uh, take time yet to uh, research that. So I'm I'm, I'm all working on uh, getting the holes drilled on the right spot, and I use the skin as a uh, as a template for uh, keeping everything. On the right spot, because I didn't really like the fitting on the on the right side, because there was a lot of tension on there. I now do it the other way around, so now I start on the right side and see if uh, how that works to get a better fit. I guess here I uh, left my camera on and I'm working on some uh, some parts on the workbench, which you can see. Okay, continuing building my pie in the sky.